Well, I... Sorry, I just, uh... I just clicked to go live, and uh, it said that I was disconnected from the server. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I just couldn't help it. I uh, was in the middle of working on a lore video, and then everyone on Twitter was telling me that the servers were live early, that everyone was online and playing the game, and I'm sitting here going, ah... Do I really want to be working on a lore video right now, or do I want to hop in the game? And uh, I want to hop in the game. So that's what we're going to do. I tested the server a minute ago to make sure it was still online before I broadcast, and it was. Uh, but I just tried logging in, and it said I got disconnected. So we'll log into the game, see if we can get on in, and uh, pick up right where we left off. There we go. Looks like it's. It looks like we're okay. So here's the plan. Oh. All right, uh, there we go, we're back in. And there's a lot of activity going on, so we're gonna hide. Okay, here's the plan. Uh, I, uh, I, am go I, I am going to continue to do lore videos for my channel, of course. I will continue to do lore videos for Fallout Noir and, I'm sorry, <laughs> I said Fallout Noir. No, 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 no. For LA Noir and all of the Fallouts, of course, but as this game is so new, I do kinda wanna um, play it a bit. So we're going to be doing some regular live streams on this channel. We'll be live streaming today, we'll be live streaming tomorrow, and we'll be live streaming the day after tomorrow, uh, at least. And then we'll possibly be doing some more uh, streams. I don't know how long my stream will be today. Uh, it'll, I'll, I'll go as long as I, as I can. Uh, I'm out of cigars, so I'm, I'm not going to be able to smoke on the program right now, but uh, I have a box of cigars coming. So when they arrive, I'll be sure to stop and, uh, and uh, smoke on up. Uh, but this is where we, we left off. So when we last left off, I raced up here from my camp to get to the Pleasant Valley Ski Resort because it's here where we had to find out information about the Order of Mysteries. But sadly, the server went down right as I was in the middle of, um, of doing this quest. So. You know what? I kind of want to start over. I want to start this part top of the world. Are we at top of the world right now? or is, Oh, that's top of the world over there. Okay, so we're not at top of the world just yet. We're getting close. Anyway, I want to uh, continue with this quest. Let's stop uh, tracking that one. Stop tracking that one. Go to side quests. Yeah, this is the one we want. Kill a Wendigo, let's stop uh, tracking that one. Declutter our interface just a little bit. Solid Gamer says, how are you playing this today? I don't know. It's supposed to be released tonight at nine o'clock p.m. Pacific time, my time. That's midnight on the East Coast, but it's early. I mean, here I am. It's, uh, <laughs> I don't know. People, the ultimate sword says, tell me this is a joke or tell me a joke. Um, uh, no, I can't think of anything right now. Robotom says Fallout Noir. Now that I would buy. Okay, I think I need to go that way. But I want to explore this real quick. We ran through this really quickly, and I feel like I missed a whole lot. So we're not going to do that right now. We're going to take our time and explore this little train sa uh, station. Not a public crossing. All persons are warned not to trespass. So this, I believe, is one of the train stations on the main train station line. One of the ones that can be added via our map. And it looks like I'm already thirsty. Man. Let's, uh, suck down a Nuka-Cola and a Nuka-Cola cherry and some purified water. Do I have any soup? Let's get a Sal Salisbury steak because I'm getting hungry. Let's drop that. I don't want that. Suck down a blood pack. Oh, that didn't do anything for my 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 thirst or hunger. Huh. I think there's a perk for that. All right, so we've got some. We are surrounded by super mutants right now, so we do have to be careful. But I want to explore this little train station. We see that there's a raider logo on the back, which means that the raiders have been here. Can I see the power armor? Sure, it's um. Not much. It's just a raider suit of power armor, and I'm missing the arm pieces. I picked up the chest piece 
uh, during my live stream yesterday, or the day before, uh, whenever it was, a few days ago. Oh. Okay, so they put a little mannequin to sleep. And uh, when we go back to the ski resort, maybe I'll pick up a few more raider pieces while I'm there. The video I was in the middle of working on that I wanted to publish uh, in a few days was uh, things I wish I had known before playing Fall uh, Fallout 76. Uh, and I was in the middle of working on that when, <laughs> when I learned that the servers were live and uh, I just couldn't, I couldn't turn this down. I, I got, oh, I hear, um, I hear music, oh, gotta find, oh, there it is, it's right in front of me. All right, we'll turn that radio off to avoid demonetization. Excess adhesive, sweet. So it looks like the raiders had turned this into a bit of a raider camp. Here's one of their platforms. Oh, man. What was that? oh, that's the raider camp. So yeah, the raiders got completely wiped out by these super mutants. They're just all over. Oh! Nuclear protection on a budget. All right, let's head up here and explore the uh, train station. Then we'll go clear that raider camp and then go on up to the main ski lodge. It's a medical supplies vending machine. Ooh, we actually find some caps here. I wonder if I can sell some of my excess aid. I don't use chems. Can I sell it? I can't sell. Huh. Well, it is a vending machine, so. Okay, ammunition. How am I doing on ammunition? I've got 350 balls left. So there is that combat shotgun. Only does 72 damage, though. That's a lot less than my 108 tactical refined double barrel shotgun. But you know what? Maybe we'll... We'll try it. Let's let's try it. And combat shotgun. And then I got my black powder rifle. Whoops! I did that wrong. Uh, okay, I'm trying to remember what my wheel was like. So my shotgun is here. And then that is my rifle. Okay, so, reloaded, reloaded, and we're, re uh, we're reloading this one. Okay, got to make sure we're fully loaded. Hey, welcome new member, Matthew. Second. And account says, don't mind me, just playing, paying for my ad block. Love the content, man. Well, thank you very much. I do appreciate it. Okay, we're fully reloaded and ready to go. Sounds like there's a vendor in here. Reminder, any attempted five-finger discounts will be reclaimed and paid for with said fingers. <laughs> it's a vendor bot raider. Note to the gourmands. Human flesh is not acceptable tender here. <laughs> and of course it has raider dialogue. Ah, man, no caps to barter with again. Ooh, a short radium rifle. Oh, level 40. Death Tambo? Now in Whoa. stock. Goods acquired through questionable means. What is that? Oh, man. Well, I'm not going to try it out because, you know, I'm not a melee character, but that's an interesting new weapon. Okay, there's my stash. Let's go ahead and, uh, actually, I should probably break down my stuff. Hey, there's, hello. The Kenpachi-san. Looks like he's doing the same quest I am. He's uh, got the same mask on. Let's break down our scrap. And then we can deposit it here to lighten our load. 
Great. How are we doing on Fusion Core? I've still got two, and they're still pretty full. All right, let's go down and uh, let's clear this raider camp, because I believe that's going to be part of the, lo the lore video I need to do on this. And then we'll head up to the ski lodge. Let's see, we've got raider camp, train station, that ski lodge, this ski lodge, and then that cabin. Man! and I still miss. Oh, well, he's getting closer. I wish I could change weapons while reloading. That's a really long reloading animation. Shots is so nice. <laughs> All right, who's at me now? Time for some shotgun. I am after all. Oh, that's so great. The two shot reload of uh, the last shotgun I had just made everything so long. It just took forever. I don't know if you noticed from my last videos, but it would take forever to get through it. What have we got? Can I loot that? Yep, 308 rounds. 308 rounds, purified water. Got ourselves a nice floor safe here. What's that? Is that a snow ski? I was kind of hoping it would be an interesting snow ski weapon or something, but no. Metal helmet, raider core, and an end of dungeon steam. Am I already encumbered? How am I already encumbered? Hey, endurance bobblehead! How am I already Oh, I've got, oh, I've got the grenade. I should have dropped that off at my camp. Okay. Let's go back up to our stash and drop off the experimental MIRV. <laughs> oh, we dropped a, a melee bobblehead. Buddy, do you want your melee bobblehead? It's a melee bobblehead. Don't you want it? I'm not going to take it. I don't know if you dropped it on accident or what. But... Spices. Another dead raider. Crossbow bolts. One of the ma rarest ammunitions. I should probably cook some of the stuff up. Maybe I will in a minute. We should go drop off our junk. Ski pole. Apparently has uh, junk on it that I need. Screws and aluminum, I'm assuming. Another safe, wow. For everyone saying that uh, they thought the release was tomorrow, yeah, I mean, it's, uh, it's good. <laughs> hey, another combat rifle. I'll scrap that for mods. It's a little confusing because it is tomorrow in places like Australia. So they should be getting it now because now would be there tomorrow. But it seems like instead of just restricting access to them, 
they uh, opened it up for all of us, at least on the PC. I hear that that uh, the Xbox players are also able to log on right now. I can't confirm that, of course, so take that with a grain of salt. But as you can see, I am on the PC and I'm able to play. Okay, so I think we fully explored that. Let's get some more mods from our hunting rifle and then go back and unload. Plastic fork. I think I got everything. Glowing resin. I wonder what the glowing resin does. Lots of ski poles. Hoping to get some good screws out of that. It's screws that I uh, am <clears throat> really low on. I'm only looting as much as I am now because I know that I've got a stash right over here at the train station. So just a short, uh, quick hop and a jump away. You know, one thing I was hoping to do before I started my live stream was to really figure out uh, at what levels to get which perk cards. I was going to get that all sorted, but, uh, you know, it's live now. Sebastian says, hey, I love the content. Man, I ask how many times you've been attacked by other players in Fallout 76. Uh, just one. I've only been attacked uh, one time. Scrap the jump. All right, is there anything I'm holding that I can scrap? Uh, short combat rifle for the mods. Short hunting rifle. Single action revolver. I really don't need that. Anime Man says, Ox Xbox in Canada is not yet live. Okay. Well, thanks for checking. J.A. Bristol says, Should I pre-order now so it's guaranteed to download to my Xbox when, I, when it launches and risk being left off the website? Ah! And that flies off the screen. Well, I don't know. I mean, it, you know, it's, it's up to you. Do what you think is best. But uh, I do know that those who bought physical copies are having to wait for them to be delivered by mail. They're not getting a digital copy that they can preload. At least that's what I've heard from a lot of people. So um, buying a digital comp digital copy may be the best bet. Now, I'm not specking into grenade launchers or the experimental MIRV, but doggone it, are these cool weapons or what? I don't want to scrap them. Uh, I know I should, but you know, now that I'm in power armor, I could scrap all of my other armor. I really don't need it. I've got two left legs. Raider power armor left legs. Let's equip this one and scrap that one. Is it as easy as that? Do I have to... Can I just... Why did that one... What's the weight difference? I don't understand. This one weighs zero. This one weighs 12. Greater power left leg. Weightless leather. I'll keep all of my legendary armor, but I'll scrap the rest. Okay, first person. There we go. Timothy says, my power noodle hoodie arrived and it's fantastic. I heard the Bethesda will stand up single player servers after release. Well, that's good news. Congratulations on the hoodie. All right, uh, let's scrap that. I like my union uniform. I'm going to keep it. It's just really loud. All right, I'm storing all my junk. I think my my thing here is full. Let's give away some ammunition. It's a lot of ammo. Like the 10 millimeter ammunition saves me two pounds. Fusion cells saves me two pounds and missiles and the plasma packages. K 
Caleb says, been watching since summer. Thanks for all you do. All right, let's give this away. Maybe they could use it. In, uh, in It's like every vertebrate in the game is having an aerial battle right now or something. What the heck? And then there's one guy shooting. There. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Of course. <laughs> I was right. It is every vertebrate in the entire game. What the heck? <laughs> they're vertebots. Well, they're attacking the raiders exactly where I was going to go. Oh, man. That's going to mess up my lore video. Daggone it. This Vendor unit is equipped with anti-theft measures. Don't get any ideas, chump. Chump. Okay, I gotta keep the blade of Bastet. I gotta keep the voices set. Now, look, how am I doing encumbered-wise? Okay, I've got a ton of food here. I might as well eat some of it. And then there's a cooking station over here. Let's cook up what I can. At least I thought there was. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, I know that robot calling me chump. What's the deal, robot? Okay, what can I make? Nothing. I can't break down anything. I'm just carrying way too much aid. That's the problem. Do you realize the bobby pins weigh more than most ammo types? I think they should fix that. Is that true? Weight 0 0.1. Weight 0.0. .0. 0 0.006. Yeah, you're right. Bobby pins weigh more than ammo. <laughs> oh, well, this is part of my problem. Look at all this really heavy ammo I've got. I still have those five missiles. Let's drop the missiles up here so that someone can uh, find them in case they want them. Because I don't want them. And I can't sell them. That's the problem. You can't sell ammunition. Isn't that infuriating? Syringer ammo, I'm just not going to use it. I just don't need it. Fuel... Flares. I'm gonna keep the cross bow bolts just because it's such a cool weapon. Grenade rounds. Ah, I mean, I love thump thump. This one does look like up close. What the blazes is going on here? 
It's just a carnival. It's just an absolute carnival out here. <laughs> what is with all these vertebots? Okay, let's uh, finish our inventory management and go to aid and just get rid of some of this stuff. Blood packs, and I don't need all of that. Bourbon, Cajun rice, and look at all this dog food I've got. I'm just gonna drop the dog food. Double gum, clam. Dandy boy apples. All right. Well, let's let's continue exploring, and as we go, we'll just. Uh, how many of those blasted vertebrates are left? If the vertebrates would just die. Vertebrates would just die, I could go forward and turn my music back up. This is just insane. More missiles. Another grenade launcher. Holy cow. A syringer? Wow, this guy was carrying everything. A 50 caliber machine gun? <laughs> ah, I'm getting more than I need. All right, is someone attacking me? I keep It's the guy next to me that keeps getting attacked. Well, let's go put this machine gun down. I'm not going to shoot them down because I don't know why they're there. You know, I don't want to, you know, an M M79 grenade launcher. It's different than Oh, it's the same one just with different mods. Okay, so I could scrap one. And then the 50 caliber machine gun. Oh, look at that sucker. Oh, man. Okay. Up to the lodge. And as soon as the vertebrate is done, I'll turn the effect volume back up. You know, I think, uh, I think... just coming from all directions. Look at your death. But this is weird, because this is the place I pretty much cleared at the end of my last stream by myself. So I don't understand why there's such a cacophony right now. A zealot's switchblade plus 30% damage to scorched. Uh, too bad it's a switchblade. Let's check it out. Oh, I can, I can use it. <laughs> okay, let's turn the volume back up now that those blasted vertibots are done.
Whew, man, that was crazy. Okay. All this scrap and junk. I'll take the ski pole. That's the top of the world. I don't want to go there. Let's go to the lodge. Let's see, to continue with the quest, we need to go to the other side of the lodge. But let's explore this lodge first for the sake of lore. This out here is called Cutthroat Crag. You can survive the, can you survive the thrill of the most extreme trail in the east? Cutthroat Crag coming soon. So this is where the Raiders got their logo. The logo is a pre-war logo for Top of the World. And the Raiders just uh, co-opted uh, co it for their, for their own use. All right, let's head inside. Ski, West Virginia. I'm surprised so many players are here. I'm here because this is where I logged out at, but um, you'd think that if this was day one of the, of the live game, that people would be over in Flatwoods and places like that, not here. Uh, it took me 35 hours to get here. Loose screws, okay, that's blocked up. Trading post downstairs. So we got a Raider trading post downstairs. We'll check that out in a minute. Let's go on to this balcony and see what we see. Does this lead to a room? Nope, leads to an end of dungeon steamer trunk. Wait, is there an upstairs? Let's see if there's an upstairs. We'll go upstairs first and then go downstairs. Oh no, it's blocked off. This okay. ski resort has been a great base down to the mountain to pray, up the mountain to stay. <laughs> I love it. There's another ski sword, but you can't get mods for a ski sword. Let's try the Porta Diner. Oh. Get my perfectly preserved pie. Hey, what's this? Bobblehead lock picking. Just in the nick of time. Let's go ahead and use this so that we're not encumbered by it. What's this? Harlan's up to no good. Oh, come on. Let's try it again. Talking crap about you again, David. This time, I'm gonna record them so you can hear it yourself. I know, Arlen, I know. But what are we gonna do? David's not a very reasonable man. You saw what he did, Margie. He killed those innocent people who came to help us. He killed them in cold blood. And for what? A few measly supplies? Now, Harlan, 
Trouble in Paradise. Uh, this is fascinating. We found Margie's corpse up at the Temple of the Winding Path. She apparently was the leader of this raider gang, but she may have been, what, a good raider? Devin says, hey, Ox, do you know uh, when the Canadian servers are up? I'm completely in the dark about this. I wish I could tell you. I'm shocked that the uh, North American, or at least West Coast servers are up. They shouldn't be up right now. <laughs> But they are, as you can see, so I don't know what to tell you. Uh, let's see if we can... There we go. Pleasant Valley Ski Resort, Grand Lodge Network Administration. Pleasant Val Valley Intermail. Uh, please select a message to view on November the 16th, 86. Wow, okay, so this is after the Raiders took over. Regarding community message board, from Larmai to Largan, I know you don't want to keep scrubbing the message board, but dang it, these rumors are getting out of hand. I am not seeing Davy. I wouldn't be caught dead with that half wit. Look, Tony, I can make it worth your while. Just lock Mark out of the system for a couple of days. Heck, with all the problems we've been having lately, you can just say it's more network trouble. Uh, two days later, intranet. Hey, Tony, I'm having trouble accessing my intramail. Could you swing by and check out my terminal? That was from Eerily to T. Lagrin. 1118, intranet's down from Harrington to Lagrin. Hey, dork, intranet's down, fourth time this month. Think you can get it back for an entire week this time? Devin says, I'm in Alberta and nothing. Well, I'm sorry, I wish I could help you. 11.18, again, Alex's post from R. Talon to T. Lagrin and A. Harrison. I'm with Alex. You need to get your stuff together, man, or someone's going to beat it out of you. Uh-oh. Trouble in paradise. And that final one on Memo. Again, from D. Thorpe to T. Lagrin. Mr. Lagrin, this morning I received a memo addressed to all of you nice guys. Well, I recognize that the current network situation may be a source of considerable frustration. I do not appreciate being addressed in this manner by my subordinates. Meet me in my office in the top at 2.30. There are some things we need to discuss. Wait a minute, the bombs dropped in 2077. This was, was written in 2086. I was assuming they're raiders, but it sounds, I mean, this doesn't sound like a raider. Oh, that's weird. Devin says, not just asking questions, I'm supporting my favorite also. Well, thank you very much. I appreciate your support. Network, network administration, mainframe, internet, and operations all on error. Multiple systems failure detected. We can reset the user passwords. Oh, please set a user to reset their password. Oh, my gosh. Oh, wow, we can reset everything from here. Let's reset Brody's password. And we've got his password. Hooray! We know that we needed that. Let's go through all of them. Just in case. Unable. 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 Oh, this was the password we were looking for. Ah, uh, when the server went down a couple of days ago, and that was the end of the beta, uh, the beta, this is what we were looking for. We had to come to this terminal and reset his password. Now we have access to that terminal since we couldn't uh, hack into it. Uh, just for the sake of being thorough, I am going to go through each one of these. <laughs> it's weird. The raiders here were speaking to each other as like co-workers. Not, um... I'm done. I'm not going to go through them all. I know that all I need is Brody. Fantastic. Right. And what is this? This is a bit of a, uh, a ski sport shop. We've got a skiing outfit and another ski sword, multiple ski swords. Got Who's this guy? some scary raiding gear, but maybe you're looking to buy an upgrade or two. Sure thing, vendor bot. What you got? Uh, let's see. Board, board, board. A grenade launcher. Hulk. Were other players able to sell I their weapons like to this guy? knowing that everything I sell spreads anarchy just a little further. <laughs> spreads <laughs> I love knowing it. everything I sell spreads anarchy a little further. Well, that's nice. 
Notes. Ooh, lots of plans. Hunting rifle NV scope. Plan M79. Raiding is a good life. No rules. Survival of the fittest. Raider power headlamp vault boy. Okay. So lots of good stuff. Let's see if we can read the terminal back. Oh, look. Bobblehead small guns. Sure, why not? Resort manager's terminal. No unauthorized personnel. On Jul uh, January 10th, 2076. To Carl from Karen. Carl, we've had a terribly mild winter, so I was wondering if you could consider running the snowmakers overnight for the next three weeks. Guests at the resort have been complaining that the powder just isn't ideal for skiing, and we don't want them heading home thinking about going someplace else next time. I realize this will put a sprain on the units, but we must do everything we can to make our guests feel like they're at a premier resort for Appalachia. <laughs> 32876 from uh, Sarah to Karen. I got your mail, Sarah. Believe me, I am well aware uh, that the slopes we have at Pleasant Valley are not exactly Olympics caliber, but we must make do with what we have. That's why I would like to get some input into changing Trail C to something more exciting. That trail certainly isn't challenging, but I think if we upscale the marketing on it, we can give the impression that it's dangerous. I was toying around with ideas and I came up with Cutthroat Crag. Do you think you could mock up a flyer pushing this new idea and go over it with me tomorrow? And the next one, from Carl to Karen, did you switch on the snowmakers or did we have a freak blizzard last night? The entire area is covered in fresh powder, which is unusual, well, almost impossible for this time of year. Either way, the timing couldn't be better. We have a VIP guest who just rented out the entire facility to take advantage of the fresh snow. Someone rented out the entire facility? I'm going to need you to get on the phone and get everyone in here right away. We need to be up and running in two days. I know that doesn't leave you and your team with much time, but do the best you can, and I'll see that everyone gets a bonus. <clears throat> so that was a few months before the bombs dropped. Well, that was over a year before the bombs dropped. And the next one, 1130, from Sarah to Karen. As I'm sure you're aware, the Pheasants on the Run event had mixed results. I'm not sure how you talked me into this event, but having guests ski down shenanigan trying to hunt pheasant was not only ridiculous, but dangerous. <laughs> that being said, we did have the highest attendance in ski rental sales on Thanksgiving in the last several years. Oh, and before I forget, could you please send a get well soon bouquet to the poor guest that accidentally wiped out when her ski caught on one of the fine five pounders? Thanks. Jay McKibe says, I'm listening in my car, and the gun sounds in the distance in game feel like they're out here. So strange. We'll be home and can play. We'll be home so I can play too. Well, good. I hope you have a good time. Okay, and then the next one, the actual year that the bombs dropped on February 18th. To Carl from Karen, I'm only going to say this once, so you might want to print it out and mail it and tack it to your wall. I rode the lifts this morning and was absolutely appalled at their condition. Not only were they noisy and vibrated terribly, but they were filthy as well. I found empty champagne bottles shoved between the seats of my car, and some rich, spoiled brat carved his initials into the plastic. This is unacceptable. You and your team have a week to get the lifts back into peak condition, or you'll be hunting for a job somewhere else. Tough words. You got a little pink bubblegum bear. You should take up the raiding life. Take what you want. Kill people that deserve it. Oh yes, that's wisdom. Worked out well for the people here because they're all alive, right? Right. Okay, what do we got? Ooh, there's a little uh, hardware. Oh, I think we were in there. Let's head downstairs. Now we've got the key to Brody's terminal, so we don't have to worry about that. Uh, what is this? Oh no. We're looking for an ID card. Uh, 
Oh no, don't make me hunt for an ID card, please. Please don't make me hunt for an ID card. I really don't want to hunt for an ID card. Oh, I bet it's in there. Maybe it's not. This is the manager's office. Keep your eyes open for an ID card, ladies and gents. Oh man, I don't want to spend a month trying to search for an ID card. I just don't want to do it. I like knowing that everything I sell spreads anarchy just a little further. <laughs> Let's head outside. Yeah, here's that little work area on the other side. Not seeing an ID card. Maybe there's one behind the counter that we missed. ID card. ID card. It might be in one of the other buildings too. That ID card is a quest reward. Is that is that true? Okay. And I'm already encumbered. Well, let's, let's consume some food. Danny Boy apples. There we go. Not even close. We've got all sorts of stuff we got to consume here. Nuka-Cola. Okay. Did we go in there? I think we did. Oh, we can't enter from this side. Hey, we can scrap here. Yes, please, scrap. Any weapons I need to scrap? Nope. Any apparel? Yep. Okay, moving this way to explore the other buildings. Level up! Oh, okay. Yeah, all right, I'll level up. Um, okay. Well, uh, I know I need to put more in intelligence and perception. Let's try intelligence and then go to... Bandolier. I'm trying to remember what was on my list. Not Gunslinger. Lucky Break. No. I should get my next Lone Wanderer. Night Person, Party Boy, Rifleman. Expert Slugger. Let's just do the next uh, Lone Wanderer because we know we need to get that and I haven't gotten it yet. Lone Wanderer owned one. And let's put it up to four. Sweet. That's the final level of Lone Wanderer. Great. Said 
there's a door over here blocked in. Okay, now, on to the main event. We've got the, the cabins over here, and then we gotta find Brody's terminal. Adam with a tip. Thank you very much, Adam, I appreciate it. It's nice that those guys came in with the Vertibots. <laughs> Ooh, look what the Raiders were doing here. Oh, they were burning people on a pyre. This place is just trash. Look at it. Some uranium in that. Okay, what's out here? Not us. I ran out of, uh, I, I became encumbered as soon as I hopped up here. Okay. Lewisburg ambush. Oh, these are the same notes we read last time, right? You hear about the ambush down in Lewisburg? Another one of those girls, they had the drop on her, and she still managed to take out half of Carrie's screw before they brought her down. Got the old man himself, too. He still owed me for a poker last week. Think there's any caps left in his stash? Okay. We're back on the quest. Ooh, look at this guy. These guys died at the podium. Anything behind the podium? Baseball bat spiked rocket mod and ran away. Let's go through it again because uh, it's going to be better for my lore video to, to have things in a cohesive narration instead of all split up. All right, so following this way, let's see if there's a terminal, looking for a key. Ooh, what's this? Floor safe. It's been barely a week since the bombs fell and supplies have become scarce. The former guests at the resort are exploring the feasibility of sending out scavenging groups to hunt down whatever they can find. What's starting to dawn on us? is that there will be people outside the resort sending groups of their own. Who knows if they'll be friendly or simply take what they want. Instead of waiting to find out, we've concluded that our goods should be locked up for safekeeping. It's a smart move and one that will keep our belongings protected until the government rescue teams arrive. It's good to know that there's still some rationality left amongst all this chaos. Let's see if we can pick this safe. Ah. All right, lock it, I guess. The assassins. Yeah, I can't believe it either to think a couple of girls in that crazy getup carried out all those hits. I mean, sure, I've killed a couple of people, roughed up a lot more, but their body count must be off the charts. And we never even caught a glimpse of them before this. Still, you have to admit it's pretty funny to think we've been cowering from a couple of teenagers in Halloween costumes. The diehards must be laughing their butts off. We read that one last time. I want to make sure we didn't miss one, so I'm going to go through slowly. Heading upstairs, we find the corpse of another leader. Moving over here, what do we got? An end of dungeon steamer trunk, hello! Raid, a corpse of another raider. How did all of these raiders die? Buff tats, rad X. 
All right, so let's move this way. Another, lots of grenades. Hey, you guys want grenades? Raider corpses is the place to go. Harvey's deal. Yo, you freaked out about all those mysterious assassin, uh, assassins slinking around in the shadows, afraid your crew is going to be hit next? Your old pal Harvey is just the thing. Missile archer to the face. One shot from my little beauty, and all that's left of the girl will be smoking craters. I'm looking for a new gig. Double cut of the loot, and I'm yours. Hit me up if you want to talk. Harvey. Man, are, are people breaking ranks in the Raider gang? Oh, there's one down there and one over there. Well, let's go right into there first and then we'll go down. Hey, science bobblehead. I, I, have I collected three bobbleheads since arriving? I think I have. <laughs> That's a lot of bobbleheads. All right, let's go up here first and then we'll hop down. Hey. Oh, I hear music. I hear music. Hold on, I gotta, I'm gonna have to turn off this dog on radio. Where's the radio? There it is. I turn that off, there we go. Before I get demonetized. Okay, where was I? Autopsy board game. What was that? That didn't sound like a scorched. Well, maybe it was. <laughs> it sounded real. Okay, uh, Tony's orders. Tony, Brody said his girl came through. He has the tape. Head over to his room and start digging. If it's really, if this really is what he claims to be, we can finally put an end to this order of mysteries, Thorpe. Okay, and I think we're right back where we were. That last one. Down there. I remember now. All right. Let's go down. Loot the last note. Keep an eye open for an ID card. Screws, screws. I'm not seeing an ID card. I don't want that ID card. Uh oh. Oh, looks like somebody triggered it already. Okay. So this comes out here, <clears throat> but it's the wrong side. We need to go around. Uh, military ammo bag. That's going to be important for ballistic fiber later on. Okay, rounding the corner to read the last note. Keeping an eye open for that card while we can. Try again. Nope. Jake's note. <clears throat> Snake, you sure you don't want in? Hawk said those girls never hit the same checkpoint twice. That makes North safer than wherever it is they have these days. Think on it, all right? Girls hit checkpoint? Could you please lower the sound effects volume? Okay. There, turn that down a little bit. Okay, now, to get Brody and his stuff, we need to go, we need to head down here. We'll explore those cabins in a bit, but we gotta head that way first. So, there are a couple of ways to go about this, as we learned from our last video. We see that the icon is over there, so we could walk along here. Aha! And we find a raider corpse. Then we can pick this.
And we're in. Now, we just need to finally use Brody's password. Hooray, we're gonna finish this quest finally. Uh, guest Brody Torrance, Pleasant Valley Intramail. Regarding the Checkpoint Massacre, let me see if I have this straight. Mac Frazier and his entire crew were wiped out by a girl dressed as a comic book character, and you, a young man I've never even heard of, managed to survive and befriend her and convince her to let you go? That is perhaps the most audacious lie I've ever heard, but very well, I'll play along. We don't have any better leads. Meet you with the girl. See what she wants, but I still expect you to make your quotas. So someone offered to betray one of the mistresses of mystery. And the next one, quotas. You're almost, uh, from Thorpe, from D. Thorpe to B. Torrance. You're almost 200 caps behind this month, Mr. Torrance. Spending too much time with your new girlfriend? I must say, for all your stories, you certainly don't have much to show for it. We've lost eight more men to mysterious ambushes this week alone. Either she needs to put up or you do. Regarding the deal... From Thorpe to Torrance, you can't possibly be serious. I tire of this charade. Rose will dispatch five men to Summersville to set up this ambush of your to set up this ambush of yours. You will join them. If your stories are true, if you do manage to kill the girl, return with her head. If not, my men will be returning with yours. One or the other. Regarding success. Very well, you have my attention. From this point forward, your sole mission will be to eliminate this Order of Mysteries and their assassins. I am promoting you to lieutenant with a team of seven men of your choosing and a private suite in the Black Diamond Lodge. Continue to surprise me and you will be handsomely rewarded. Fail and your star will fall as quickly as it rose. I guess we can presume that he was successful, Brody was, and he managed to kill a mistress of mystery and... Uh, Hack off her head, jeez. And the next one, uh, regarding the spruce knob ambush, from Thorpe to Torrance, what makes you, what what makes three, uh, that makes three successful hits. Judging by the reports, they put up quite a fight. It seems these are our mystery assassins. Tell your girl that I accept her offer. If she can deliver her tape, assist us in rooting out this order of mysteries, I'm willing to offer her and you anything that lies within my power to grant once this once the job is finished. Oh no, I think I have an idea of what happened. Oh no. Regarding the mother load, excellent. I'm sending Tony over to help you analyze the database. Work with him and Rose to map out your ambush plans. We'll pick them off one at a time and say, stay the final raid and stay the final raid against the manor until we've thinned their numbers. Have Tony begin trawling the data for other leads, too. If their records are as extensive as you say, this could be a tremendous asset. Finale. A bit anticlimactic, but it does save us the trouble very well. Go meet your girl. Make sure there aren't any loose ends. When you get back, report to my office in the top. We can discuss your future with the cutthroats. Oh dear, I think I know what happened. Mount Holotape Drive. Loading Project Siphon Holotape. Mounting external holotape drive. Loading Project Siphon Holotape. Read me file found. Displaying read me file continue. Oh no, it's what I thought, no. Here's the tape. I've loaded it with my login credentials and a full copy of the database. The mission board lists all of our operatives for the next two months. That should give you plenty of potential targets. I need to lay low for a while. Stick to the plan. I'll see you when it's time for the final operation. Tell Thorpe I expect him to keep his end of the deal or I'll be coming for his head next. Olivia Rivers, man. It was her own daughter. Oh, that's tragic. Oh, no. For those who, who missed my previous episodes, I mean, I guess I don't want to spoil everything for you, but 
So if, when you go to Riverside Manor, you learn that Joan Rivers had a daughter named Olivia. She and her husband were training her to be a mistress of mystery, just like her mother. But the, her, the daughter had a bit of a bad attitude, you know, typical teenage angst, that sort of thing. Joan Rivers was really frustrated with her. Her dad was still supporting his daughter. He didn't want to pick sides. But we kind of left it at that. We didn't really know what went on. Come to find out, Brody is the one who masterminded an attack to wipe out the mistresses of mystery with the uh, with the help of a girl. Turns out the girl was Olivia Rivers, their daughter. <sighs> Holotype contents, Project Siphon Exfiltration, Read Me Cryptos Database. The Cryptos Database and the Cryptos Login. Olivia Rivers, view the Cryptos Database. Oh, so they had access to Kryptos from here? And she could log in as Mistress Natasha Hunt. Spicy says, have you checked out the updated Atom Shop yet? Glad to see your attitude about this game compared to a good amount of other YouTubers. I haven't checked out the Atom Shop yet. I'll, I'll, I'll check it out later. Does all of this say... I think this is all exactly what we read in the previous terminals. Yep, it's all the same. So they were able to hack completely in. View readme file. Here's the tape. Oh, it's the same thing. Okay. Dispense siphon holotype. Mr. Olivia Rivers login added. Order of Mysteries Cryptos Holotape added. Now to gain access to the headmistress's office. That is just tragic. Oh. That just breaks my heart. Okay. Betrayed by her own daughter. Man. Well, uh, okay, well, we uncovered the great, the great plot. Now we need to find out whatever happened to Olivia. Let's continue with the quest, but while we're here, we need to finish exploring Top of the World because, uh, you know, it looks like we've almost completely explored it. So why stop here, right? Let's finish exploring Top of the World. Ronald Smith says, love your stuff. I can binge watch for hours. Keep being awesome. Well, thank you very much. You are so kind. Oh, let's push the button. <laughs> Who needs keys? Ah, whoa! Lag spike. Holden Mikramix holotape. I don't rec recall this one. Ever since the bombs dropped, the former guests at the ski resort have lost their minds. If being a member of the honorary mock label yachting society has taught me one thing, is that preparation <laughs> is the key to survival. <laughs> it is locked up their belongings. Split up the access key, stashing away valuable items we could be using for barter. Every decision being made is foolish. Instead of using this facility as a headquarters and sending out hunting parties to look for scraps, we need to find a new base of operations. We should band together in larger groups and take anything we find along the way. They're convinced the government is going to rescue them, but the, the truth of the matter is, we're on our own. The only people that can help us now are ourselves. Wait. Wait a minute. Does that mean that the Raiders used to be the rich the rich people who stayed at the resort? Is that how the Raiders here started? <laughs> what? Oh, okay. That would be interesting if that's true. Beer hat. Hey, look, it's a beer hat. I don't want it to weigh me down, but hey, if you want a beer hat, that's where it's at. Let's see. Did we check this terminal? I think this is... Yeah, we checked this terminal when we were here last. Lost item. Yo, Brody. Arena schedule. Entering it down. Okay. Yeah, we did that. So... We've got those cabins over there to explore and the top of the world 
to explore. Ooh. I think I remember getting a treasure cap, a treasure map that had those in it, but that would be south. Oh, great. Oh, perfect. Okay, I just got a cigar delivery. Uh, so hold on a second. All right, so uh, ladies and gentlemen, I just got a cigar delivery. Important things. If, if I'm going to be live streaming this for the day, I've got to, of course, open my, my box of cigars. So give me a second. We've got some La Aurora Corojos. It's a process, but it's worth it. Guys, crack me up. <laughs> okay. My first arm piece. But it's level 25. Level 25. What? What level am I? 24. Okay, I'm almost level 25. So this was some sort of combat arena. Man, what went on here? Look at all of these. Uh-oh. Bit of an issue. Oh, and I can walk right through them. Uh, also, we learned from those terminals, from that terminal, that they split up the key to uh, to the supplies underground, right? So it's not one key we're looking for. We're looking for a bunch of keys. Ooh, what is this? Why waste ammo, right? 
what's this? Chauncey's note. Dear Lord Miller, my darling, I don't think that I'll be able to make him home and- <laughs> ah, 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 ah. <laughs> Gosh, dang it. My darling, I don't think that I'll be able to make it home in time for the winter festival you had planned at the estate. I know I promised I'd return right after my vacation at Pleasant Valley, but it appears all transportation services in the area have been disabled thanks to this troublesome war. Holy cow, the raiders all came for rich guys. But don't fret, my love. The government is certain to send a military unit to rescue us, and soon we'll be re uh, reunited. Oh, and until I arrive, don't forget to feed the peacock. <laughs> Chauncey. This is ridiculous. His name is Chauncey. He, he lives on an estate. He's got pet peacocks. <laughs> so dumb. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I like the message that they're saying. Okay. Crevard water. Canned dog food. Oh no, that's very shit there. Come back, shotgun. I'll take that. Now, I was over here. Oh. It's a bit of a target practice hut. Lots of papers, and you'd think that if there would be part of a hollow tape key card, it would be in here. Somewhere then. Let's see. Fold detective case file, Charleston Herald. So this is all paper, paper, junk, paper, junk. Hop on top. Where does this go? Okay. All right, well, let's go upstairs. It says keep out. Let's do the exact opposite. Oh wait, we were here, weren't we? I am gonna just, I'm just collecting everything. I have all the junk. And then we went upstairs. Okay, let's check out the rest of the uh, cabins. How do I have nine fusion cores? I thought I started with two. How did I get nine fusion cores? I don't remember looting. Hey! Scrap some weapons here. I've got way too many combat shotguns. Let's uh, scrap this one. Let's see if we can modify this. Up, oh, can't power armor. Let's see. Modify. Ooh, an automatic receiver. <laughs> Say goodbye to my ammunition. Okay, what am I, I need a uh, fourth rank of gunsmith. Right. Let's do automatic. Let's do true long barrel, standard long barrel. Range and accuracy goes up to 60 and 30. Yeah. Just consume some of my scrap here. True short stock. Accuracy goes up. Standard sights, dot sight, sure. No muscle. Then let's uh, repair it. Oh, that's right. I'm holding this legendary. I'm holding these two legendary weapons, which I don't really need. Uh, let's repair it. Repair it. Let's consume as much of this as scrap as I possibly can. Make room for more. Might as well repair it. It's a good little weapon. Any mods for my... Um, 
I think I might have discovered everything for this particular weapon. Yeah. I don't know if I'm getting any more new mods for that. Okay. Feeling good? Check out my new sh combat shotgun. Ha <laughs> I love it. So the Raiders had, uh, this was their Bazaar, I guess. And then that's top of the world over there. Okay, I think I need to explore this building. I haven't explored it yet. Plastic, Ooh, more plastic. Am I, am I still encumbered? No, I'm not. No, oh, yeah, 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 I am. Hold on. Man, I'm still encumbered. Ah! <laughs> I'm just, I'm just totally done. Forget about it. See out here is their patio. With their view of the ski slopes. Oh, this door's busted. Okay. Looks like we got to go around. This leads to the rooftop where we can get some cigarettes. And move on over to this guard tower, lookout station. There's nothing there. Let's head on upstairs. Oh, that's right, I am holding those power armor pieces. Ah, no. Requires level three. Okay, Ooh, is that Bambi? Hey, Bambi. All right, now, uh, there are a few cabins over here that I did not explore. I kind of went the, the ampas away. So let's go explore those cabins, and then we'll go to top of, top of the world. And then we'll go return our quest and find out what happened to the Order of Mysteries. Oxhorn, just wondering, do you keep levels and items from the beta? We do. I'm playing on my level 24 character uh, that I was able to level up during the beta. I'll check that power armor frame periodically to see if I can find any more pieces on it. All right, cabin's over here, then we're almost done with top of the world. Where? Yeah. I'm getting a ton of plans. Maybe my plans are uh, holding me up here. Plan. They're heavy though. Look at all these plants that I can't consume because I already got them, but they're a quarter of a pound. I don't need them. I don't want to sell them. Just gonna drop them. Same with recipes. Let's go through all of the recipes I can. And then if I can't learn them, I'm just gonna drop them. Five of those recipes, if you can believe it. Five. All right, and the rest don't hold weight. Great, I can carry as many of those as I want. I'm still 275. Am I carrying any missiles? <laughs> the fusion cores are three pounds each. The fusion cores are three pounds each. What? How is the fusion core three pounds? I'm just not realizing that that's an incredibly heavy fusion core. Holy cow. Three pounds each? But that's insane. How is a fusion core three pounds? Oh. Oh, okay. 
How am I at the point at level 24 where I'm I have too many fusion cores? <laughs> I'm in my power armor 24/7 and I've got too many fusion cores. Uh, okay, is there anything else I can scrap? I can scrap this Raider power armor in one level, but I don't want to scrap it now while I'm still using it. Weightless trapper arm, it's legendary. I can't scrap that because it's legendary. Can't scrap any of those. Those are legendary as well, and the other ones I'm using, I'm just too much trouble. Ah, any more scrap I can scrap? Scrap all my scrap. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. Let's eat and drink. How about that? Let's drink, let's drink our heavy Nuka Cola. A cherry for good measure. It's all that Nuka Cola cherry. Some preserved Insta Mash. Let's just eat it. Eat all that Insta Mash. Salisbury steak, yeah. Just down the hatch. Three pounds per fusion core. That's ridiculous. Okay, cabins. Going to the cabins. Oh, come on. One thing that I I dislike about this game is the reload animation. It automatically reloads. Instead of instead of forcing you to manually reload, it automatically reloads for you. And during that time, you can't switch weapons. While you're reloading, you're stuck. You're just stuck there reloading. I don't it's good. I bet that's like a 5-pound stealth boy. I don't want to bother with that. What is that? A plan? Ridiculous plan. Recipe. It's a recipe. R R R R recipe. Where did? Oh, that's right. Notes. Okay. Well, that was new. <clears throat> um. So, I mean, if you're using a weapon with a huge reload speed, like the uh, black powder pistol. Even if you only want to use it for one shot and then quickly switch to a much faster weapon, you still got to go through the reload animation because it automatically reloads. And I dislike that. Plan Plasma Gun. Man, I'm just kidding. <laughs> this is the plans and recipes. Plan. I'll learn it. Might as well learn as much as I can. Reduce my carry weight along the way. Shotgun shells. That's a double barrel shotgun. I'm going to be upgrading from the double barrel shotgun soon, but you know what? I'll take it for the mods. There is a weapon crafting bench here after all. Recipe fried deer skins. Three recipes. Mmm, fried deer skins. Nami. Hope you like some gristle with your hair. Aluminum, aluminum, nuclear material, aluminum. One thing I'm not finding is the uh, key, the key parts. <coughs> Why? <coughs> Man, you gave me blood worms, you doggone rad roach. Use a disease cure. Sealed specimen jars in there. Okay, let's scrap down the weapons that I just looted. Thankfully, a weapon workbench right here. Uh, weapons, short combat rifle for the mods, yeah. All right, well, one cavern down, two caverns to go. Off to cavern number two. Oh, another for the razor burger, infused chip flower tree. Oh, what a fool. I already know it, so I'm gonna drop it. What? Oh, right in front of my face. Huh. 
come on. Oh, and it's locked. Of course it's locked. Where are you coming from? Where's... There's another one in there somewhere. You sound sick. Sounded sick, like it was coughing. Okay, we got a bit of a Raider bunkhouse here. Screws. More teddy bears. Skiing outfit. Shotgun shells. All right, I'll get the double barrel shotgun scrap for the mods. Stem pack. Dirty water. Red plate. It's not plastic. Ceramic. All right, one more cabin. To the bathtub. I think I picked up, what, four or five recipes just by exploring the cabins? Another double barrel shotguns. They're dropping like candy now. Skiing navy and orange outfit. Oh, I bet that's like uh, a more rare version of the skiing outfit. Ooh, plastic on the toothbrush. Office desk fan. I think I've got, ooh, what's that? Rory's holotape. Oh, I hate this bug. <laughs> I found the mother load, baby. Some bunker tucked away in the swamp. Yeah, I bet it's got supplies for at least a couple of years stashed away inside. Now it's just a matter of breaking in, but the damn girl holed up in there has got some, some sort of terminal controlling the locks. On the He's door. talking about Abby's bunker. <laughs> if I didn't suck at hacking, I'd be in there by now. Four tries and you locked out. That's bullshit. But I'm gonna let anybody else know. That place and everything inside's mine. No sharing here. Matter damn password. I just gotta wait for that Abby chick to, to leave and then come back. I sneak in the door behind her. And bam! <laughs> She's dead. And I'm living the dream. Is that what happened to Abby? Was she killed? Oh no! Oh no! 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 You can't do this to me, Bethesda! You can't leave the servers online for a couple of hours and then take them away from me. You can't do this to me! Come on, man! I can't do anything. I'm, su I'm stuck. Server not responding. Controls have been temporarily disabled. Where'd you get all the new power armor pieces? There was an arena here at top of the world with a frame inside and on the frame were uh, randomized pieces. I got the two legs uh, at the last day of the beta, then I got one arm today. So all I'm missing is one arm on my suit and then I've got a full suit of Raider power armor. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Why are you doing this to me? Why? Go! 
says I can play. Okay. Let's try this again. Maybe maybe we just got kicked out. Let's let's try it again. It says it's online. See that game server is online. We'll see you for launch day on Wednesday, November 14th. Oh! Hey! Reclamation Day is here! What? I'm so confused! I am so confused! What is going on? <laughs> I'm logging in! I still have all of the armor that... Didn't I loot Rory's holotape? Oh, I'm all the way over here. Okay, there are the cabins. And the... ...since are back. Great. Okay, well, we gotta fight. We gotta fight. Let's go this way first. that other armor now. Oh yeah. It needs to be repaired, but I can equip it. Well, let's see if we can find, let's see if we can find a, a, a repair bench. Am I still being, okay, there's still something out there. All right, let's be sneaky in my Raider power armor that sounds like a tank while moving and with a lit flashlight. Oh, great. I hear a nuclear code. Am I gonna have to hunt that down now too? Ooh, a pumpkin pie. Oh. I bet that's delicious. Only 20 years old. I'm totally eating that right now, pumpkin pie. Mm. Oh. There it is, lads, look at that. <laughs> Silo Alpha. Got it. Too bad I have to collect like ten. <laughs> 
out of ten of those things, and they uh, they despawn. I learned that the hard way. I had a collection of four or five uh, launch codes, but because I took my sweet time in uh, gathering the rest of them, they reset, and I couldn't use them anymore. I know I've got this. Oh, let's see. Recipe soap flour tea. Recipe, 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 recipe. So flour tea. Yeah, I've got that. How about that? Recipe blood bug pepper steak. I know I have that. Swing pack, sweet plate, whiskey, whiskey. I've got plenty of fluids. Okay. Ooh. Any keys on the hooks? No. No admin password back here. Go for the computer outside. Is there a computer outside? All right, I'll check it out. I still want to get into that basement. I want to get into that basement. <laughs> what is this? Oh, another bunk room. These guys were taking Kim, Stimpak, World Water. Really, the only Kims I need is Radex, Radway, and Stimpak. Everything else I just don't want to bother with because it weighs me down. So this is a roadside motel next to the big resort, I'm guessing. What? Oh, it's another player. Okay. Okay, well, that's it. I didn't see a terminal outside. So let's go back down and finish exploring that last cabin. And then we can finally go to top of the world. And then we could go back and turn in our quest. And then find a way to get rid of all of this stuff I'm carrying. I don't remember that. Sorry about that, but I gotta speak loudly over the uh, radios. Steeped Strangler Pod Tea. That's a new one. Man, I'm, I'm collecting all sorts of stuff. Plastic plate, hot plate. Infused blood leaf tea, I know that one. Oh, Nuka Cherry. Nuka Cherry drops a lot. I have a stack of Nuka Cola Cherry in my Can't loot that. Yeah, but I can't loot that. Marksman's hardened sniper rifle. Suppressed hardened sniper rifle. Okay, so it's what I got. And I think I've got all the mods for that particular weapon, so I don't really need it. They were uh, blasting Wagner on the radio. Take me to your cheese. Is that a, a reference I somehow don't know? Trevor's note. Mike, I'm coming down to see the latest artifact as soon as I can. I'd like to bring an expert with me, a Mr. Christopher Weed. I trust him, but a background check might be in order. We're getting close to the truth. Regards, Trevor. Is this in, in connection with what we read at vault -Tec University? If you watched my video on vault -Tec University, there was something... One of the professors there, I believe his last name was Professor Blake, had found something to do with runes. Does that have anything to do with it? 
Welcome, Mr. Green. Security system error credentials. Access required for key generation. Invalid credentials will activate hostile security. Generate one-time key. Access denied. Credentials. Access required for key generation. I've got to find Mr. Green's credentials. Oh, man. See, I have a feeling like... <clears throat> I have a feeling that they're... Uh, that there are so many side things connected with all these locations. So I'm gonna dis I'm gonna discover a location and I'll do a video about all the lore there, only to realize later that there are 50 other things that bring you back to this location because you gotta find key fragments to unlock a terminal or something. Man, what is I wanna know what's in that terminal. Okay, this was cabin number one. Oh, and of course, I bet everything has reset itself. But that's the third and final cabin over there. I want to explore that. Then we can go to top of the world. Let's get Rory's holotape. I think we lost it somehow. Ah, oh, I hate that black. QR, Roar, Roar, Rory's holotape. <laughs> I found the mother load, baby. Some bunker tucked away in the swamp. Yeah, I bet it's got supplies for at least a couple of years stashed away inside. Now it's just a matter of breaking in. But that damn girl holed up in there has got some, some sort of terminal controlling the locks on the door. <laughs> if I didn't suck at hacking, I'd be in there by now. Four tries and you locked out. That's bullshit. But I ain't gonna let anybody else know. That place and everything inside's mine. No sharing here. matter getting that damn password. I just gotta wait for that Abby chick to, to leave and then come back. Then I sneak in the door behind her and BAM! <laughs> She's dead. And I'm living the dream. Okay, that's it. So we did we did listen to the entire holotape. <clears throat> Uh, I don't know if you can hear it, but I'm hearing a bunch. All right, sorry. A after the reset, it reset my audio, so let's turn the music all the way down. Let's turn the effects down a couple of notches. I already have my microphone turned all the way up. If I turn it any more up, we're going to get a bunch of clipping, which would sound horrible. So I turned down the music in game a bit. I turned down the effects a little bit. Things should be better. Sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. Shotgun shells. Oh, no. Looks like everything respawned. When the server went down, everything respawned. Oh. Does that mean that the power armor also respawned? Oh, <laughs> look at that! Hey! It did! Yes! I got 10 fusion cores now! <laughs> Sweet! Well, what, what level was all of that? 
Do I at last have... Okay, so it's still level 15. Left arm. Left leg. Right arm. I finally have my right arm. Right leg. Torso. Oh. So the torso was still a level 15 torso. At last, I have a full suit of power armor. Yay! I need to find a bench to repair it, though. Okay, let's, let's scrap everything else that we've got. Because that's just... just Weighing us down. Scrap the junk. Then let's scrap the unused power armor pieces. Like this one. That helps. I'm still encumbered, but that helps. How did I loot that? That's nine pounds. Okay. Now, top of the world. Gotta relight my cigar, hold on. This place was filled with scorched earlier. Let's go around back and see what's over here. Still encumbered. Oh, it's not fun playing this one encumbered. It's so not fun being encumbered. But I gotta have everything. I've gotta have it all. Looks like this is a an observation point. Uh, some sort of camp down there hasn't fully loaded looks like another shack I don't know what that is top of the world let's find a way up Okay, I need you to find 
the plans, build the repeater, and patch it into the array following their notes. Easy peasy, right? I'll take the rest from there. We'll be in business. Rose and, uh, whatever your name is. Okay, oh, she just gave me a big quest. I don't know if I want to do it right now. Madigan is dead, but a raider robot named Rose knows where the scorched detector uplink he was trying to set up is located. She won't tell me anymore until I gain her trust by completing a series of tasks for her. Complete Rose's quest to gain her trust. So that's a main quest. I now have three main quests. Wait a minute. Okay, I see. So these two are part of that same raider quest. I don't want to do that right now. I want to finish this side quest that I'm on. But hey, at least I discovered top of the world. Now I can fast travel here. Cryo cell? That's a first. Well, uh, since this is now involving another quest, I don't think I want to explore it. So let's head back to camp and scrap what we've got. Oh, that's right. I can't fast travel. <laughs> oh, where's my camp? Oh, uranium fever. Now this is where I need to go. How do I get rid of 35 pounds so I can fast food? <clears throat> do I have any grilled rad stag? I already scrapped all the stuff I don't need. Oh, I can get rid of, oh, but those are legendary. God, do I just drop a legendary item? I don't know. It's too nice to drop. I don't need my gas mask anymore. I have my Raider power armor. There's a lot that I'm just hoarding. This is a problem. My, in my heart, I'm a hoarder. That's that's the problem. I'm, j I'm just a hoarder. Oh, I can get rid of my ski sword because now I can use the blade of Bastet. <laughs> Sweet. Let's make that the blade of Bastet. So I can go and scrap my ski sword now. A ski sword. <clears throat> oh. Am I carrying 35 pounds? What am I carrying? Oh, yeah. You daggone blood bug. Yeah. You too. Join your brother. No more. Mm. Now, where was I? Uh, let's sort this by weight. Can I consume 35 pounds? First, let's sort by spoil. Anything spoiled? No. Okay, now let's sort by pounds. What can I consume that's really heavy? The super stim packs? Yeah, fine. Fine, fine. Let's, uh, get rid of my rads. Take my super stim packs. Oh, all these stealth boys. I don't need them. I'm just going to drop them. Um, I should cook up that up, but I really don't want to bother right now. So let's drop that. And then it's all Nuka Cola. I don't need the vodka. Let's get a little bit drunk. Don't need the tick blood. Healing salve? That's heavy. Don't need the dog food, but I'll eat it. Now, all right, let's get rid of a little bit of dehydration. All right, 10 more pounds. <laughs> 10 more pounds. Salisbury steak. Vegetarian ham. That's against my religion. Let's drop that. Uh, all right. That's 0.35 pounds. All this boxed food. Let's drop the boxed food. I don't need the boxed food. Cream, deviled eggs, all that. Just get rid of it. All right, five more pounds. How can we get rid of five more pounds? Look at all this purified water. Let's drop the boiling water because I've got purified water and the dirty water. Now what am I at? One pound. I need to get rid of one pound. Okay, I'm going to drop one Nuka Cola. Oh, it's not even that. It's 0.7 pounds. I got to drop one more. Let's drop a Nuka, a Nuka Cherry. All right. We can fast travel. Now, fast travel back to our camp and then complete the quest that we're actually on.
ox you can rope it up and wear a two quarter cloak armor, which you have at the stash. That's right. I do have T45 at my stash. Thanks for reminding me. Let's check it out. Oh, but I don't have a power armor frame here. Apparently I'm, hol I'm holding junk that I can't scrap. Let's transfer all the junk I am holding. Really? How did that wood taste? Oh, my generator's gone. Apparel. <clears throat> Let's see, I've got T-45. Yes. Okay, level 25, 58, 58, 58, 40, 40, 40. No brainer. Right arm. Level 25, 34, 34, 34. 24, 24, 24. No brainer. Okay, so that's uh, two items I can scrap. Okay. So what am I at in terms of encumbrance? I'm still really, really close. It's all these weapons, I think. It's only one pound, two pounds. I love this little weapon. It does 108 damage, but uh, my combat shotgun, man, it does so much less damage, but it, it's so fast. Let's store that if we can. I don't need my ski sword anymore. 62 damage compared to my 65 damage. They are both medium weapons, and this is 10 levels higher. Okay, let's scrap those. Wait a minute, can I not scrap? In the voice of set, I am gonna store. Black powder rifle, okay. Let's repair some things. Now I just need a power armor frame so that I can repair my power armor. Can I build one? I don't think I can build one. Um, it's locked. I have to find plans to build the power armor frame. That is so annoying. I don't know if you know this as uh, I don't know stuff, but you can bulk up your junk to save space. Also keep up the good work, love the content, thanks. You know, I thought the same thing, but uh, upon further inspect uh, inspection, bulking scrap doesn't save weight. It just makes it so that you can sell it. Which is frustrating, I know. Look at that beautiful T45 on there. Uh, okay, let's... Let's go through my ammunition. Don't need that. And 
And I don't need any of the... Well, you know what? The, uh... There is a rifle I wanted to try out. Oh, I can scrap... I can scrap this. Okay, a few weapons I can scrap that. I'm never going to use that. Let me scrap it. Now, I've got this hardened combat sniper rifle. It just does so much less damage than what I've got. I can scrap one of these. Let's scrap the level 25 one. A 38 caliber night vision sniper rifle. I can scrap that. I can finally use my handmade rifle. It's rare. This is the only one I've found, I think. And then there's this level 35 machine gun. Stabilized short barrel. Okay, let's modify my combat shotgun. See if I can add the, sh the new barrel to it. I need gunsmith for that. Stabilized short barrel. The range goes down. So I don't really need that. Now, my, my hardened sniper rifle is only a level 20 item, but it does 88 damage. And yet, the combat rifle does 40... It does half the damage, but of course, it's semi-automatic. I want to save all my 45 caliber ammunition just in case I want to use this rifle later. It is a higher level rifle than I've got. Uh, it's semi-automatic, though, so... The rate of fire is 33. The rate of fire is 3. <laughs> so, uh, let's try it out. I'm going to store my hardened suppressed, and I'm going to take my hardened combat, and let's uh, put it on our quick menu just to try it out. Okay. Well, let's try it out. So then, in terms of ammunition, where does that leave us? With a lot of ammunition I don't need. I do need the 45, but I don't need that. That's 0.2 pounds. 0.2 pounds for the grenades. I don't need that. I'm going to keep those just because I really like them. Cryo cell. And then fusion cores. I can store some of my fusion cores. I need my shotgun shells. Okay, so I'm slowly coming down here. Let's store some of my fusion cores. I don't need all of them. Holy cow, that's a lot of fusion cores. Let's store the entire stack of seven. I don't need all of that. And the cryo cells, don't need those. Cryo bolts, don't need those. Store those, don't need those. I only have one 50 caliber ball. I should probably make more of those. And I'm, use I'm not using that now because I stored that particular weapon. So I've got all the ammunition I need. Let's make some let's make some balls here. Tristan says I love watching your videos and always look forward to a new one. Store your fusion course. Thank you, sir. I did figure it out in the end. Let's uh, 50 caliber balls time five. Okay, I'm feeling better. Where's my weight at now? 164 out of 175. It's still not the best, but then I am. I, oh, I'm still. I still am holding all of this junk. Let's store that junk. Store all junk. Now let's go through junk and see if there's anything that we can sort by weight that I can just get rid of. Composite ski. I need to scrap that. Can I scrap these two? And then the rest is all bulk stuff. Bulk, bulk, bulk. Beer bottle. Ballistic fiber. And then loose springs. Okay. 
The all the rest is all scrapped down. Can I scrap what I'm currently? So apparently there's some junk that I can't scrap. Look at that. I can't scrap the hallucinogen gas canister. And I can't scrap the beer bottle. Well then I'm gonna drop it. Because they're the heaviest things that I'm holding right now. Great! Well, if I ever get the plans to build a, a power armor station, I can start consuming some of, some of my scrap uh, to repair my power armor, but until then, well... Good. Let's go turn in this quest. You can scrap them. You just have to do it manually. Oh. Hey. Attacking me while I'm reading the chat. That's very rude. Oxhorn, you can level up. Wait a minute. I level... Didn't I just level up? I got the exterminator perk card while being attacked by rodents. I'm so confused. I just leveled up to 25 before the, the server went down. And I've been wearing the Raider power armor this entire time. What? Look, I still have that point into intelligence. What in, what's going on? Level 25 and I'm only a, a quarter of a way into it. Yeah, I was at six intelligence before I I'm so confused. Okay, well, um... I guess let's choose, choose another perk card. Commando, don't need that. Rifleman and... I've already got Rifleman and Expert Rifleman. 